I realized we never spoke about what what was in that package in Mexico. The, the package that we were chasing around town the last day of Cancun. Well, we were trying to get this. There you go. This is a Charles Schwab debit card. This is what we were looking for to help us out with traveling long term. My actual real debit card is at home. All I do is just transfer a little bit of money on here and then this is what I travel with. And this is what I use to go to the ATM and take some money out. This is the best thing you need to pull out money in different countries that you go around. Just go to ATM, use this, and you're good. You don't have to carry a lot of cash on you. It's just this card. If someone steals it, cancel it. This, and, and they'll ship it to you anywhere in the world. And that's what we ended up doing. So, if you're going to go traveling, even if it's short term, it, but you don't want to carry a whole bunch of money, just have this, and you're good. So, it's the Charles Schwab debit card. That's all you need. And then go ahead, go ahead and have fun traveling and no worry about the exchange fees or anything like that. Don't say I didn't tell you. I like Duolingo because you can learn how to speak in any language. Niño. El hombre. El hombre that you can even type it in, in English and in Spanish and it's very interactive and very actually interesting <laughs> and me and Moby can do it every morning El Pan E-L Pan The Bread El es un niño El es un niño Es He is a boy and you can do it in any country so as we're traveling around the world Yes. If we're in France or Germany, we can actually learn those words. And when we can learn it too. So we both get to learn. We, we have a way to communicate, mm -hmm. which is something that's very important as well. I like Duolingo. It's really good. Okay. What's going on with my people? Been a little bit out of there because I caught the, uh, I don't know, I caught some damn stomach virus. Maybe the travelers, uh, truck travelers virus or something like that. So we really ain't been doing much, kind of just been hanging around trying to edit a few videos and get some stuff done and recover. So right now, as you can tell, we're in a laundry. Hi. Trying to get some laundry done so we don't be traveling with those stinky clothes like last time. Oh, <laughs> From this one. Say hey, my people. Mm. Say hey, my people. <laughs> Say hey. Say hey. 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 <laughs> so she's just up there chilling. Doing her own thing. Practicing her walking. Yeah, it's got our kicks on. Ready to hit the streets. So, I don't know. Probably I'm gonna wash his clothes. <sighs> Go clean up a little bit. Cause we kind of got a little, we need to organize some things. Let me say that, not necessarily clean up, but better organize our things. And um, I don't know if we do anything else, we'll sure keep you guys posted with us. I'm like, we're going to go back and add some other videos. Yeah. The, way, the, the way the videos are coming out, we trying to do daily vlogging. <laughs> <laughs> daily videos. Mm -hmm. But we need to catch you guys up, cause we need to catch you guys up, y'all behind. Y'all still in Mexico. We're not in Mexico no more, boo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> in Colombia. So, yeah. Oh, I think that's too big. I think that's too big. So, I don't know. So, I need to get a shave somewhere, too. I'm looking a little rough. Hey. I don't really shave it. Razors. I normally just do clippers, and I don't have a pair to shave. So, hopefully, one of these days, I can find me a little barbershop and get me a little shave. And, yeah. So, having a little issue with the washing machines because it's all written in Spanish and we don't know how much money to put in. So she went to the front to go and ask them. Hopefully they can come over here and help us with this because we just got used to the Mexican pesos and now we're getting used to this, you know, um, Colombian pesos and it's totally different. So, yeah. And she's kicking it with me, like always. <laughs> ah!
Is that so? Tell the people how you feel. That's how you feel? Yeah. Pick him a coffee. You gonna clap for him? Pick him a coffee. Pick him up. Not you. Don't hit yourself. Pick him a coffee. Pick him a coffee. Stop being so shy. You so shy. Pick him a coffee. Pick up my coffee. Can I, can I get a kiki? Mwah. Can I get a kiki? Can I get a kiki? Thank you, honey. <laughs> So guys, we got the washing machine situation sorted out. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, show it on here. So when you look at it, to wash is 10,000 Colombian pesos. That's essentially, is how much did we say that was? I still, I'm still trying. Okay, hold on, I can tell you. We got it right here. That's essentially $2.50. Well, we don't have enough change for the dryer. So they have like this little bakery spot across the way, a little restaurant. We're gonna go swing by over there and grab a donut and get some change back. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna show you guys a little. It's a nice little spot. Um, it's not like the one. Oh, one What was the name of it? I really like it. Um, I don't know. I, every, every grocery store, every place you go to, they always have like these big old bakeries. Oh, you're talking about the grocery store? The grocery stores, the bakery spot we went to, and we just can't ever pass them up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can get like a bag full of bread for like pretty much like two, three dollars. You know, maybe like cinnamon rolls, uh, all different types of pastries and stuff. Yeah. It's pretty good, so. Yeah. I mean, granted, we're not doing much like you said, but. We're doing the administrative work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the behind the scenes that needs to yes, get done. Yes, because clothes need to be washed. Videos that got to be edited. Yes. And cleaning up, mm -hmm. organizing so everything can run smooth because we got plans tomorrow. Yes, so see you guys. <laughs>
an exchange for like only like fifty bucks. But it's also and he uh, had brought out and he had said two hundred thousand Colombian pesos, and we were like, what? And then we just saw this come out, little numbers like this, and we were like, what the heck? And we were thrown off. We were like, how are we gonna figure this out? But then now. But it's not even just that no. too. It's also doing the conversion to our money, also. Yeah, right now, so. one thousand. But no, one dollar is three thousand nine hundred. I forgot what the other numbers was. I think forty-five. Mm, I guess. Three thousand nine hundred forty-five Colombian pesos. I have to double check to be sure. As long as you know that, just kind of times it. You'll get a hang of it. You know the best way I do it. I just know fifty is two hundred. If I see a hundred k. Is 25 and then you just do the math like that or choose whatever numbers that work best for you so yeah or what three thousand roughly four thousand and one mm. so just choose whatever works for you but trust me we still gonna go low so somebody she be <laughs> she tired <laughs> she, i'm sleepy mama she waiting for some food i'm sleepy baby i'm sleepy baby it's a sheep, baby. <laughs> so yeah, washing machine slowing down. Yep, one more minute left on that. We'll go ahead and put that in the dryer. And then uh, we're going to head back to the room. And do a little cleaning over there. <laughs> It's a lot to organize. Clothes we just washed. It's gotten a little bit of a mess over here. <laughs> a little bit. It's a lot. Yeah, it's a mess. Too much. So we're going to put everything in like the closet area. So everything is easily accessible and it's not too much of a mess opening and closing these suitcases, right? Yes, ma'am. All right. We're going to get to it. and clean and tidy all the clothes over there in that little nook actually to be honest they have a lot of storage space don't you think yeah. mom these stuff in here at least the ones that were we cleaned some mm -hmm. more stuff are in here in her little compression bags all my stuff are in here are in here essentially well all three and then Dre's is up here in his nook. So, it worked out. Anyway, guys, we finished cleaning up and actually getting some stuff done today. For real. So, we actually edited a few videos and we're actually going to edit this video here that you're watching. And, yeah, that's going to be it from us. Oh, yeah. And we can finally start exploring Colombia starting tomorrow because we had two days. Inside, trying to break. Well, trying to recover, mainly. And we got this start. I'm excited. Yeah, so you guys stay tuned. We'll see y'all later. Have a good day. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. <laughs>